Let's get you our top stories here on Africa Live. We begin in Somalia where the presidential election is currently underway at a highly secured location within the airport in Mogadishu. 329 legislators will elect one of 23 candidates as the country's next president. The elections come amidst raging concerns over insecurity. Cote d'Ivoire special forces have been demonstrating in the coastal town of Adiake. Some armed soldiers left the barracks while others fired their weapons in the air, sending panic throughout the town. Military sources say the mutineers were seeking a payoff similar to the one agreed with the government in January. It involved bonus payments for soldiers promised when fighting for former President Laurent Gbagbo. The Ninth U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals in San Francisco has heard arguments from Justice Department lawyers and opposing attorneys for the states of Washington and Minnesota about President Donald Trump's controversial travel ban. The court will rule on whether to restore the ban that was imposed on people from seven predominantly Muslim countries. And Australia and China are pledging to strengthen bilateral ties from trade to tourism. Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi is in Australia for a series of talks on how to improve the relationship and deal with the uncertainty surrounding the United States. And those are your top stories.